Hello boys and girls, how are you doing? Let's have a look today at what does it say about you to their friend if they say anything. Okay, so two pounds, you know the deal. Let's see, let's see, let's see that could be relevant to some of you. So one, two, one, two, we know the deal. Okay, so pal numero uno. So two of pentacles, five of swords, the stars. So, hmm. So they're going to say that, wow, they kind of like going back and forth, back and forth in their mind because they see you maybe as, I mean, it's not maybe, you're shining bright. I mean, you're the star. You are totally like spectacular and very balanced. They can see your future. They can see potential with you. They think, oh my God that person for real and so they're going back and forth and back and forth um but also they're thinking maybe you're too much for them in a sense like that person is just too amazing for me what what do i have to offer they kind of maybe wonder and they kind of doubting themselves and they share that with their friends maybe as well they went through in the past a story that was quite outrageous and based on betrayal and more than once and lies more than once and therefore they kind of like they recovered from that but they also be careful on you know how to go back on the market <laughs> if i may say so they yes definitely on the fence they definitely uh, would like to you know spend some time with you but they're afraid of committing because they know the last experience wasn't great uh and they're also someone who uh <coughs> excuse me <coughs> who is excuse me um very um you know based on the or focus i should say on their work on their abundance someone who is doing very well for themselves and they respect a lot you know when they have a relationship they treat that person like a like a gentle like a like a lady so for them it was even more difficult to understand why someone could be betraying them so badly and outrageously so they see you as someone very together very you know stable and someone who probably had to rebuild yourself financially emotionally and now you're very together so you know they feel kind of like okay is that person is stable a bit like me and that person proved to themselves that they can rebuild themselves from scratch they obviously went through quite a bit as well so they know uh, the value of love and honesty so yeah they see a very balanced um, relationship potentially and a very uh, stable and very fair so you could be the perfect match for them so yes they're like Ooh, because you seem so perfect and perfect you may very suitable to them they kind of worried um but they have to complete actually their self-doubt they have to let that go they have to you know because what you what happened is like you happen <laughs> you're not in the calendar kind of thing it was a tower moment it was something like wow okay woof who's this person and that just changed everything for them because they were maybe organizing themselves you know since i'm working i'm working i'm working this is my focus and that's it and you just like pop out what do i do right so they're gonna be a bit you know shy maybe to approach you they're just kind of careful as well but they want to make it work and i think being focused on their work so much was very healthy to make them you know um grounded again and make them feel worthy however work is not everything and you came out actually to my probably balance their life and say hold on a minute it's good to work but it's also good to have a bit of fun and to be you know together so yes yeah, so they have a little bit of anxiety and sleepless night on how to approach you they're kind of waiting and in between and kind of what should i do what should i do should i go for it they're very impressed by you for sure because you're very real and you're very grounded you're very together and yes, maybe they don't believe that they can have, you know, access to that beautiful castle. They are holding on to their foundation. They, they, it took them a long time to rebuild their foundation, so they're very careful to go any further. But they're going to make the decision to rush towards you and go for it. You might not say yes, but at the end of the day, they want to go for it. They can see the potential of you too, and it's magnificent. The how... Maybe not amazing, but um, but, it, but they will go for it because they see you as the full package. I mean, you are the empress. You're very nurturing, loving, very strong, very real, very grounded. And they're definitely very attracted to you. So, yeah, they, they're definitely going for it. And that's what they probably uh, talk about with their friend. They don't want to have any regret. And if they feel that if they don't approach you, they will be still in a limiting belief, not accessing their beautiful castle. And they obviously will miss 
an opportunity to be very happy and they will be by themselves like a hermit and they can't stay on their cave forever because at the end of the day they want to be victorious and they will so they're going to leave behind the limiting belief and maybe that's what they're discussing with their friend like i met this person that person is spectacular i know i'm a bit petrified on giving my trust again but i'm ready so pile number two what does it say about you uh, to their friend ten of cups nine of cups ace of cups holy mother of god <laughs> spectacular so what they say they definitely they met someone wow okay and that is everything they could wish for it's someone that is just like pff, that maybe there was love at first sight that was definitely not something they organize it was just like pff, and they also see that they could be so happy with you and that could be like happy forever ever ever so they attempted to approach you but they're very timid they don't actually say they all um the extent of their feelings towards you because they're kind of like maybe overwhelmed very possible or simply a bit shy and also they find you extremely attractive very hot indeed you are in the spotlight you're shining your light and you're very humble i mean you're a perfect combination and they feel like they have to be i mean they feel kind of naked in front of you in a sense like wow you know i can't you know my usual game doesn't work oh or, or i don't i don't want to play any game i just want to be real i want to be just me because that person is spectacular and i want to spend quality time with that person i want to just you know share and maybe they have a nostalgia of the idea of love and you brought that love back in their life so that's wonderful timing yes maybe they used to be with people who would be two-faced and they see you very strong and <clears throat> excuse me so you're a different caliber you know maybe they used to people who are a bit of a player they're a bit like uh, you know but you are very kind of poof, that's it <laughs> Or they used to be a bit of a, you know, kind of two-faced or playing or having the easy option. But they know that with you it wouldn't work and they want to do the right thing because they know you're very strong and they have to learn a different way. They have to learn, um, you know, how to maybe to be totally open with someone, to not hide any agenda or just to be real as simple as that. So they're definitely talking to a good friend. Because they just want some advice, they need some extra knowledge, like, oh, what am I doing? And yes, maybe they run away from um, their reality, they run away from love in the past, so maybe they were being sneaky, and that was their way of being at the end of the day. But with you, mm -mm, they can't do this. So they, yes, they have, to be, they have to battle or something, and they maybe they procrastinated as well, but they have to change their perspective. They, were, they hold on for a very long time to a way of being that was maybe just a bit of fun here and there that's fine you know pff, nobody get hurt but with you it's different it's love at first sight it's real it's out of uh, their control they cannot uh, pretend it's not happening so the usual routine doesn't work at all so yes they used to be a play i can see that so <laughs> confirmation <laughs> So they used to be like, oh yeah, I have a bit of this, I have a bit of that, not thinking of the consequences of the action, and everybody's fine, okay? But they're frustrated because they know that won't work. Because now they know they found their match. Someone who can be, you know, um, as powerful as they are, very successful. Someone who can be totally their match in the power couple. It's abundant in love, in success, in, in conversation, in intensity. They know they cannot mess it up because that that routine they used to have is not going to work and they have to drop it double check you know me <laughs> they have to do, drop the attitude drop the games they have to be real and that's probably what they're talking about with their friend et voila so on this note <clears throat> before i don't have any voice have a beautiful day and i'll see you tomorrow Mwah. ciao